Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a very <laughs> large haul. This is like Black Friday, or like the week of Black Friday, because all the sales were going on for the entire week long. So like the week of Black Friday and Thanksgiving, and then some stuff a little more recently than that. A lot of it I ordered online, a lot of it took a long time to get here, which is why this video is going up so late. But I'm also switching up the background a little bit, so I hope that this is kind of a fun background. I always just switch up my backgrounds, I feel like I'm not super consistent, but I think this looks kind of fun. So this is going to be a long video, I can already tell. There's so much stuff over here, let me just show you all this pile. Like, I don't know if you can really tell on camera, but that pile is huge. So I got like the biggest box from H&M, like it was literally like wider and taller than like my torso. So I have a ton of stuff over there, but I'm super excited to show you guys. So if y'all want to see all the deals and all the good stuff that I got for like Black Friday and just general shopping, then just keep watching. I am so excited to show y'all this stuff, mostly just because I love filming and watching hauls, but also I can finally... Put this stuff away because that pile you just saw has been living in the corner of my room for weeks so i'm going to just start off with um a lot of this is clothing and yeah it's mostly a lot of clothing but these a couple of things are not so i wanted to show you all this and this is kind of a cheat code that even though it's not black friday anymore you can still kind of probably try to get some of these deals like after christmas too and it's like these little razor gift sets so i got this uh, men's one from gillette and then this women's one from Chic with like this kind of like thicker razor. And then also this other one from Chic. And I feel like these are just the best deals because these are like I think $9.99 each. And then Target had them for like 30% off or something. So I got all these sets for like six or seven dollars each. And y'all know razors, like one razor is like eight bucks. And a lot of these have multiple. Like this has a razor with a you know head on it, plus two replacement heads, plus like those little like mini razors for like your eyebrows or your upper lip or something plus a little cover and shaving cream this one has the razor plus four heads and makeup remover and a little like protective plastic thing and then this one has the razor four replacement heads and a shaving cream and they, these say like 25 or like $30 value. And I spent like six bucks on them. And then I stock up on them because then I literally throughout the year never have to repurchase razors. Like I never pay full price for razors because I just get a bunch of them. Pay almost nothing for them and then never have to pay full price for a razor throughout the year. It's such a good idea. It's such a little life hack. So next I actually just got this very recently from Pink. I have such a different assortment of stores in here. So I'm going to try to go in some kind of order but I literally have stuff from so many places, so bear with me. This is one of their Sherpa cardigans. I'm sure y'all have seen these. They're like kind of like the main, I don't know, like exciting, cozy thing from Pink for this year, but it's literally just, it doesn't like button or zip or anything. It's just like cardigan robe almost, or like a house coat, but it's like super, super fuzzy. It has a hood. It is just the softest thing. I got the medium large so that it could just be like really big and oversized and cozy. And these retail for $80, which is obviously a little bit ridiculous, but I got an email coupon like it was an email exclusive coupon like it wasn't posted in the store for them to be $16.95 each and then I had my 20 off of 50 like bonus reward card that you get from Victoria's Secret for the holidays because I got other stuff that I'll show you so I bought three of them and the total was like $50.84 I used the $20 off so I got three of these for $30 so I got these for $10 each which is insane that's $70 off and they are just like the coziest comfiest thing ever so this is the one that I'm keeping, and then the other two I'm going to be giving as gifts, which is why I don't have them here. That is so freaking cozy. I'm going to try not to talk a ton in this video, so that's not like crazy long, even though it probably already is going to be. So next I have a few things from Abercrombie & Fitch. I mostly just stocked up. Oh, one of these things is not from Abercrombie, but I'll do that after. I really wanted to stock up on their like knit chunky hats because y'all I'm sure saw if you watched um, a couple of my other like try on hauls which I've done quite a few I can link those throughout the like fall and winter. I got the white one from Abercrombie and I'm obsessed with it like I'm kind of particular on the way that I want my like chunky like beanies to fit like how oversized and how long they are. I'm just kind of particular and I fell in love with the way that the Abercrombie ones fit so I ordered the gray one the red one actually sold out online, so I had to go track this down in store. 
and then the pink one and I already have the white one so I have these four from Abercrombie everything was 50% off for Abercrombie for Black Friday and I actually didn't really like the black one I didn't like the way it fit for some reason it didn't fit the same as these did so I ordered this one which is I mean it's pretty similar it doesn't have like the cable knitting but it's got like the same like chunky knit design and this just has a plain black pom-pom which I kind of wish it had like a brown pom-pom like all of these have like a kind of like different colored pom-pom than the actual hat so I kind of wish this had that but that's okay I really needed just like a black beanie because I didn't have a plain black beanie believe it or not and this one is from American Eagle or Aerie and this was also like half off so now I am stocked up on beanies I love these I highly recommend these ones in particular they're so good so y'all are probably gonna notice a theme here and it's a lot of active wear because I like go to the gym so much now that like I just don't have enough pairs of leggings and like workout tops to like last me throughout the week without doing laundry every day. So it's a lot of activewear I wanted to stock up on. A ton of leggings for the same reason and I'm also going to be doing like a legging like showdown kind of video where I just try on like a ton of different leggings from different companies and see which ones I like. So y'all will see those in this video and then a lot of just like sweaters and stuff. Just because I'm like 30 pounds lighter than I was this time last year so I'm a lot smaller so I needed to definitely like revamp my wardrobe to fit me. Basically this item I actually recently just got as well from American Eagle I have just been like obsessed with American Eagle and Abercrombie and H&M lately. You'll see a lot of that But these are super high-rise plush leggings, but they're not really like leggings. They're Almost sweatpants, but like tight fitted sweatpants where they're tight to your leg kind of like a legging But they do have like a drawstring and they are like the softest velvet I've literally I don't know if I've ever felt anything this soft. This is probably the softest material I've ever felt in my entire life I'm not exaggerating like it is it is butter soft and I mean it feels a little bit less soft on the inside it's not the exact same material but it's really soft on the outside I got a size medium I wear a medium or a small but usually a medium in most things and these just are <laughs> insanely comfortable and soft and I feel like velvet leggings are kind of becoming a thing right now you'll need to get these from American Eagle everything will be linked below like always oh my gosh I'm so happy that I have these these are so good and I just stumbled upon these I didn't even go there looking for them I just like found them and I was like like, how are people not talking about these? These are the best thing ever. Next, I'm going to go into a bunch of workout clothes from Forever 21. This is actually technically from their activewear line. It doesn't really look much like an activewear piece, but it technically is. And it's just like this cropped sweater. As you can see, it's kind of like got a cool like ribbed detail. And it's got like a v-neck with like these two little strings. And it has like this little hood on it. It's like very cropped though like as you can see it goes like really short in the front and then it's a little bit longer in the back and then it's kind of got like dolman style sleeves and it almost looks like it has like a raw hem. So it's just like a super comfy like casual little workout piece for like if I'm not doing anything too intensive at the gym or even just like throw over my crop top or my sports bra. This is just like something cute and comfy. It's like fairly lightweight. I run errands after the gym a lot because my gym's in a good area. So I end up going out and about after the gym. So I feel like this is just a good item. It just feels really, really nicely made. It feels like good quality. It's a little bit like thicker. It just feels really nice. So I feel like this will be a really cute, like a little bit more of a stylish gym piece to just like throw on. And then these other items are a little bit more, they look more like active wear than that does. So I got two colors in this little like cropped hoodie kind of thing. I do love Forever 21's little like athletic logo. I don't know I feel like it's kind of cute even though you won't be able to see that because of the hood but this is a pink it's kind of got like the bigger armholes and it is like definitely super cropped I like most of my workout stuff to be cropped since I wear like high-waisted leggings so I got this pink little cropped hoodie and then I got the same exact thing in like this teal color which I think this color is just so Beautiful. I just feel like this is gonna be so cute because it's just like very simple and it is like a uh, It's not like super cottony feeling but it does feel like an active Material if that makes sense. They feel really good. I'm 
always really really impressed with Forever 21's like quality at least in their activewear because I have a decent amount of their activewear already and it feels so good this especially I got this shirt in three colors because I love it so much and it's super simple again it does have like their little logo in the back but this is just a really simple like boxy cropped t-shirt it's super simple it has a little bit of like longer sleeves it's like not super cropped as you can tell but it's definitely like a flowy shorter fit it's got like some nice detailing like it's got this stitching along the collar and like kind of that little like band across the chest and this material is just it's so like stretchy and breathable and it just feels like it's kind of thick and heavy also so it just feels like it's going to be really really durable and nice to work out in so i got the peach color and then i got the same exact one in black which i feel like you can never have enough like plain black workout stuff and then i also got it in white so i'm super stocked on the workout t-shirts i also am pretty sure all of these t-shirts and these little like hoodie things i got for like three or four dollars each like this stuff was basically free because it was on sale and then there was like 40 percent off for black friday so i literally got all this stuff for under four dollars each which is insane and then the last i think the last like workout top i got from forever 21 is kind of a similar concept it's just like a crop workout top but this is like a really stretchy like it feels like a workout legging material it's super super stretchy and breathable and it actually has like mesh starting at the neck and going all the way down the sleeve the sleeves are actually insanely long i was kind of confused when i put it on i was like why are the sleeves continuing to go like the sleeves are way too long for i feel like the normal average person but they do have the thumb holes in the wrist which i appreciate and maybe that's why it's super long this is kind of basic but i feel like this is gonna be really fun to work out in and then i got one sweater which i have not bought any sweaters from forever 21 this year and this one really caught my eye and i don't have anything this color so this is very different for me so it's this turtleneck and it's like this gold color which i literally do not own anything in this color but it's got all of this really cool distressing all along the neck and then it even has it obviously like throughout the body of it like it's literally just all over these rips and then it's even on like the sleeves i kind of got like really full like kind of poofy sleeves as you can see the distressing I think just looks so cool like it's even on the wrist I just think this is like the coolest most like different sweater ever as you can tell it's like a little bit on the crop side and you can like see underneath it's all like distressed along the bottom too so it's a little bit like cropped like it's not it's definitely not like very long I feel like you can kind of see it there it's like just the length where your jeans would normally hit like your high-waisted jeans I personally love sweaters that are a little bit shorter like this because it makes them easier to tuck in because I pretty much tuck like front tuck everything I wear and y'all I'm astounded by like the quality like this feels so heavy and so thick such nice quality i'm i'm truly shocked this feels like a very expensive sweater and it is not that is everything i got from forever 21 literally for all this stuff that i just showed you guys i paid like 40 bucks like it was literally i felt like i was stealing i don't know how i got all this stuff for that price okay so now i'm going to talk about some leggings and like i said all of this will be coming like all the review of these will be coming in my legging like showdown video so stay tuned for that but the first thing that i'm super excited to show you guys i got some stuff from gymshark which i've never tried gymshark before i actually got these during their like blackout sale which i don't know if y'all are familiar it's like a couple days before thanksgiving i think it was the monday before thanksgiving and they literally put their entire website like 70 percent off or something insane but it's like madness like you have to get in a checkout line or like a checkout queue i was in the checkout queue for like 45 minutes before you were actually able to check out this first pair is like this really pretty like lilac gray material and it's kind of like this ribbed material it's very like very thick obviously like nice quality feeling material it has like the huge gymshark logo on the back these are super high-waisted which i love about these and they have just some really nice detailing on the sides and they do have that little i don't know if you'll be able to tell that little kind of like under butt darker detail as you can kind of see across here and these are just such incredible quality they feel so good i've never tried anything from gymshark i was super excited to get my hands on these so those are awesome and then the other pair that i got 
is this really pretty like I don't even know what kind of color it's kind of like a pink but it's also kind of like a red like burgundy garnet kind of color these are a little bit different these are not as high-waisted as those which I do wish they were a little bit more high-waisted because I literally like my leggings to go like, up to my boobs just about but these have this really cool pretty like band along the top and these also kind of have like that under butt detailing as well and they're just so stretchy and so comfy these kind of have like a different pattern towards the bottom all right y'all so i just had to change my memory card and my battery all at the same time so if the angle is a little bit different that's why but i think i got cut off in the middle of talking about this pair but moral of the story is i got these for literally i think like seven dollars a pair and i think full price these are like $60 a pair like I got them insanely cheap and they're very 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 good quality so I do think that Gymshark is probably worth all the hype but like I said you will see all of this in that video coming up so stay tuned these are all the other pairs of leggings that I got let's begin these are actually not like workout leggings but I'll go ahead and mention these so these are by Spanx actually but these are the assets by Spanx, so I think it's like a, I don't know, a little bit of like a different version of the Spanx leggings, but these are, they're faux leather shaping leggings, so, I mean, as you can see from the picture, they're more or less the exact same thing as like the really expensive Spanx leggings that are sold on Nordstrom, and I have tried these on, I have not worn these out yet, but these are pretty, pretty cool, so they're super, super shiny. I do have a pair of faux leather leggings from Target by Wild Fable, but these are way, way, way more like leather looking and way shinier looking than those. And these are like crazy thick, crazy good quality. They have like this really nice thick band at the top, so they go really high rise and they really suck you in. And these were available on Target. They were sold out for like ever, like for months and months and months and months. And then like randomly they went back in stock. So they're definitely cheaper than the original Spanx leggings, but they are definitely like a little bit still maybe more on the pricey side for just regular like casual leggings in my opinion. So if y'all are looking for basically an alternative to those Spanx like liquid leggings, the faux leather leggings, these are a really, really good alternative. So check them out linked below okay so getting into more leggings like i said i'm just gonna go through these fairly quickly because i'm gonna have a really in-depth video about everything so i do have quite a few pairs of leggings from old navy and i have a ton of like the different styles i'm still trying to find the ones that i like the best i was really really in the market for leggings with pockets so that was what i was on the hunt for um during black friday and i found these elevate high rise 7 8 active leggings from old navy i get a size medium and these I really, really, really like. I actually ended up ordering a second pair after I got my first order in because I was like, oh my gosh, these are so good. I need to get another pair while they're still on sale. And I love the material. They're just a really nice, really stretchy, like kind of like a dry fit material. I really prefer like a moisture wicking, like dry wick material more than like a cotton legging. I like something that kind of feels like Under Armour or something like that. I just like that feel. And these are that. They're super high waisted and they have pockets on both sides which I was so excited about and then I got the exact same ones in like this like kind of burgundy they're actually showing up a little bit lighter on camera than they are in person in person they're like kind of like a dark deep like a wine color and these also have a pocket on the side and they fit so so nicely the other pair that I got from Old Navy is a little bit more of like their higher like more expensive version this is like the elevate sculpt legging and what's different about these is they have like this really really thick like this feels like a booty band like it's a very thick material and that material is also like along the thighs and down like half of the leg and the idea is that it really sucks in your waist and like sucks in your thighs and it's like more of a shaping sculpting kind of workout legging which i think is is cool and i get it but the material is different than those it's, it honestly feels more of like a cotton so i'm still not sure how i feel about these they're supposed to be nice so we'll see and then i also placed an order on ect i'm pretty sure that's how you say it apparel they're from australia and kind of like gymshark they were doing like a 70 percent off sale with like free shipping so i got this little set and unfortunately the top is a little bit too small on me. I mean, I can get into it and wear it, but 
it's definitely a little bit tight and a little bit uncomfortable that maybe if I lose more weight it'll fit a little bit better but it's really really cute kind of like a high neck little workout sports bra I like that it's like a sports bra and a top like you don't have to wear anything under it or over it because it's like just kind of like full coverage for the most part and it's really cute in the back it's got like a little kind of peephole and like this really thick band all along the bottom and I really like this design it's kind of like this like cloud I don't know kind of like not tie-dye but I think it's really really pretty so I'm really hoping that I can still get use out of this because I really do like it and then I got the matching leggings to go with it and these are so beautiful they kind of have like that V like you can see it looks like a little bit of like a layered like crossover kind of effect so it looks really cool from the front and then what I really liked about these is that the butt is kind of has that like scrunched detailing like kind of like right through your butt crack so it's again kind of like with the Gymshark it just adds like a little bit of dimension to your butt and I guess it's supposed to make your butt look a little bit better so these are the leggings that I got so these are just like a really cute matching set and I honestly kind of feel like this is like more a set that you wear for like I don't know pictures or something than for working out because there's just like so much design to it but it's a really really nice like super thick kind of stretchy but also very like sturdy materials this next pair of leggings is also not like a workout pair of leggings from Amazon actually the Satina brand I have one other pair of leggings from this brand in like a random purple color you'll have probably seen it on my channel because I'm obsessed with them they are the comfiest leggings of all time they only come in one size like one size fits all which is kind of weird but they fit me perfectly I don't know really how to explain them they're like kind of thin and they almost feel like suede but not like they're just a really really soft buttery just like comfortable legging I would not wear these for working out or anything because they're not really that kind of material and they give you like a little bit of a camel toe and they're just really not for like any intense activity but they're really good mainly just for like lounging around the house the ones I got this time were just black and so they kind of have you know a little bit of a band up here they're really 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 basic they're literally just black like lounge leggings they literally make you feel like you're naked literally like you don't feel like you have pants on at all because they're just so soft and so light I highly recommend that y'all check these out these are like 10 bucks